So let's go ahead and get Big Mama Pekka here in the back. We're going to get ourselves an Electro Wizard. We're going to get ourselves a Battle Ram. We're going to get ourselves a Bandit, a Ghost, a Magic Archer. Now, Flying Machine, I will tell you right now, faced a lot of Bomb Towers. It's going to come in clutch in the future of this battle, without a doubt. Okay, Bomb Tower, I did forget about that. But what did I say about Bomb Tower? We're going to use Flying Machine. It's going to come clutch. I'm going to go Flying Machine because he has to go in with the uh, Bomb Tower. You see what I'm saying, guys? Goes in with a... <laughs> What is this spamming at the river? Have people really not... I gotta do this for sure. Have people not realized how to play this game? One thing I will say is opponents in this range and even lower is they don't really play with any kind of skill. And I'm not trying to be mean, but they just like spam stuff. And I'm telling you, if you just play patient, you can almost win with any deck, all right? Highly, highly requested best decks for Arena 17. And we're gonna do exactly that in this video, highlighting the top three I think you guys can use to help easily push through before we jump into it. If you do play Brawl Stars, I've played casually for probably the past year or so. I did create a second channel posting Brawl Stars video. Feel free to drop a sub, definitely a like. I will leave a link to that channel in the description below. Let's jump into the video. Here on my mini free to play account. Okay, the first deck is gonna be Hog Cycle with the Evolved Firecracker, Pekka Bridge Bam. Remember Big Mama Pekka did get a recent buff and then we'll round it out with one of my favorite decks as far as it being super simple to use it is gonna be the Royal Recruits Fireball Bait deck for the first jump in and dominate with this Hog Cycle deck. Also, let me know down in the comments section down below if some of these cards you don't have leveled up and or like the Mighty Miner Unlock, things like that. I'll try to find you some substitutions. Okay, we. <laughs> my opponent goes, I don't even know what I was supposed to do there. My opponent went straight in with, like, everything at the river. Just crossing fingers, okay? We're going to be fine here. The Baby Dragon's going to be a little bit annoying to the point that I'm actually going to get the Firecracker down right now and try to take it out a little bit faster. Baby Dragon actually may not have gotten a shot off, but still, I'm not too worried. Probably going to activate King Tower here, but not too worried. Okay, Hunter. Guys, I'm going to go ahead and log this. Goes in with the... Hog Rider, I do have to go in with this, unfortunately, and we're probably going to go ahead and get this down as well. Just to try to take out that Hog Rider fast, but it does get a shot off. It's okay, though. By the way my opponent is playing super aggressive, we're probably going to be able to get some work done here. Balloon? Oh, my goodness. I have to go Firecracker here. That's going to be a lot of work. A lot of work done. All right, but we're going to be able to come back here again. I'm assuming this is the kind of players that you guys face, but Balloon at the River does get a shot off. We'll see if he uses some elixir here on the firecracker. Go, Valkyrie. Okay, so we're going to go here. I think my opponent might have the evolved barbarians. Not sure. I think I'm going to probably go in with the hog rider right now, though. Because, okay, never mind. We're going to go ahead and fireball. Take that value. I am going to go in with this as well. We're going to hopefully be able to take most of that stuff out. We'll see if my opponent decides to go. What? Skeleton army. That's fine. Okay, we're going to go here. We're going to try to see if we can get a little bit of a savings on elixir we split that up a little bit we're going to go in here my opponent i cannot go in with anything else all right my opponent is definitely going to probably get a hog hit which does stink now what i'm going to try to do here is go in probably a tower trade because my opponent's just getting very aggressive right goes in with the balloon right so i am going to go ahead and go firecracker here i'm going to see if i can mitigate some of the damage i don't know if i can i don't want to go in with anything else honestly if the balloon doesn't get a shot but it's going to get one shot um, would have been great, but obviously did not happen. So we're going to go in with a uh, Fire Spirit as well. Goes in with the Valkyrie. We should be able to get some pretty good damage there. I have to go in with the Mighty Miner here. And let's see. I got to protect against the Hog Rider and... Okay, Wizard. I'm going to Fireball this. I have to do it, honestly, because we've got to take out that Wizard. I'm going to go in with the Firecracker. Crazy enough, opposite lane. We're going to go here. We should be able to take out that Hog Rider. I'm going to pre-log here with the Hog Rider... It's gotta go skeleton army, right? Perfect, guys. That should be tower. Maybe not. Close to it, though. All right. Goes in with that. He's gonna have the. It is close enough on tower. Okay. I knew it's gonna have that. So I gotta hurry up and cycle to um, a bomb tower, guys. Again, just because of how my opponent was playing. We should be able to take this out. The problem is he's gonna have his hog rider, okay? 10 seconds. But we should be able to stop the hog rider, I think. Okay, barbarians. Let's go here. Yeah, we're gonna be good, guys. All of how my opponent decided to play have a nice day take care try to get better ggs peace out all right now let's go and jump in using some pekka bridge bam i'm actually going to go opposite lane here it does have a tesla there on the map so we'll see he's probably going to try to protect oh that was so great that was awesome guys okay let's go here with this the ghost bypassed the tesla perfect okay so what we want to do here is definitely kind of pull everything toward the middle with big mama pekka i was kind of hoping bandit would also go that way but not we're actually going to be able to dash onto no we're not okay i am going to try to do nothing actually 
Now, my opponent had to go in with the Musketeer. I'm going to go in with the Magic Archer. We are going to log the... Okay, that is going to be okay as well. We should be fine here. It's pretty expensive. Now, I'm definitely going to go in. All right, I wanted to keep Baby Dragon off of Tower, but that was a lot of Elixir my opponent spent, right? He has to go in with the Bandit. We connect. This is perfect, okay? We have to get a Ghost on the Bandit for sure, so she does not dash. This should be our game without a doubt. He's going to have to answer this ghost, otherwise that's going to be a lot of damage for us, guys. Let's go, okay? All because my opponent went Musketeer in the middle and Fireball. That's just so much Elixir spent. My opponent may opt to go in E-Barb's opposite lane. We're going to go Magic Archer here, kind of in the middle, if my opponent decides to do nothing. I was going to say Distract. Guys, this is how you make people tap, all right? When you just dominate like this. And we're going to round this out with a poison. Let's go. Have a nice day. Tapping him out. GG's. Peace out. Now it's time to switch to the Fireball Bait deck again. This one here is also a lot of fun to play. The Royal Recruits have been nerfed a couple of times now, but they're still really, really good and very, very annoying. I don't even know what to do. Valkyrie at the... Guys, seriously, let's just do this here. Ay, ay, ay. Okay, we're going to pull it back, but unfortunately the wizard locks. Valkyrie wizard at the river. Okay? That's a lot of damage. And bomb tower. Now, here's what we're going to do. We're going to go in with the flying machine. Now, flying machine, I will tell you right now, faced a lot of bomb towers. It's going to come in clutch in the future of this battle, without a doubt. Okay? We do connect as well. Flying machine's so annoying. Okay, now, my opponent doesn't have a whole lot of electro, at least up four, but he does have an executioner on the map. Now, here's the problem. Right? We get so much damage. The problem is that he goes knight. I'm going to go here. We're trying to distract just a little bit, then I'm going to go here. Now, what I'm hoping and I'm able to do is get the... Okay, this should hopefully work out. I need Brawler to... Okay, yeah, this is going to work out. Couldn't keep up there, really. The piggies are going to help. Executioner is going to be distracted. Another piggy is going to show. And my opponent just crossed his fingers and hoped, okay? We're going to get some damage here. He goes in with the Electro Wizard. All right, I'm probably going to go in with the Zappies. I have to do it because that would be a lot of Elixir. We don't get a we do get a Piggy. I thought that the curse was going to go away, but we did get a Piggy. Now, what is my opponent going to do? Put Valkyrie in front of this. What we have is the Royal Recruits. Okay, we haven't even used Piggies yet. Can we actually win without using Piggies? See what I'm saying? Like, what is this? Now, that didn't even work out, right? Perfect. Okay, we're going to take all that stuff out. I'm probably going to go Piggies here. Honestly, if my opponent... Has Mega Knight. It's going to kind of stink a little. Okay, Bomb Tower. I did forget about that. What did I say about Bomb Tower? We're going to use Flying Machine. It's going to come Clutch. Okay, I don't want to do too much else here. He's going to have to answer this Flying Machine. Otherwise, we're going to take this tower. He's got the Electro Wizard come close to taking the tower. Does have Electro Wizard. Goes in with an... <laughs> what is this spamming at the river? Have people really not... I got to do this for sure. Have people not realized how to play this game? Like, we're going to be good here. I don't even think my opponent is back to Bomb Tower yet. Goes in with the Executioner. That does stink, so I can't go in with the Piggies yet. We're going to be fine here, though. Let's go Mother Witch. We're going to go in. We're going to slow that all down. We're going to go here. And maybe my opponent spams something like... Now my opponent is back to Bomb Towers. There you go. Okay. I was going to say spam the Goblin Gang. Okay. But we're going to be fine here. Now, hopefully... I can't really do much, honestly, because of the way my opponent's playing here. Let's see, let's see. Let's go in with this here. We're going to hopefully be able to take out that. I just tell you guys, huh? Let's go here. We're going to be able to clean up the wizard. Does get one shot. That's unfortunate. I'm probably going to have to, like, arrow cycle this. I don't even know what to do. Valkyrie again? Guys, come on, man. Is this what y'all are facing down here? Okay, so let's go in with this right here. Goes wizard. I'm going to go flying machine because he has to go in with the uh, bomb tower. You see what I'm saying, guys? This, however, he does have Executioner. I got to go with the Piggies. Otherwise, I'm just, like, never going to use him in this battle. This is the first time. We're going to go in with the arrows as well. Let's go. He's going to go gang. No, nope. Execution doesn't matter. Have a nice day. Try to get better. Take care. GG's. Another dub in the books. Peace out. Before we end the video, let's see what we get from our lucky drop. It is an epic. It is an epic. Not bad. 7,500 elite wild cards. I'll take it. There you guys have it. Hopefully you enjoyed the video and learned a little something, something. One thing in particular is don't spam the river. You will not get better in this game. Thank you guys again for all of the continued support. Till the next video, take care. Good luck inside of the arena. GG's. Peace out.